Hey guys, uh, today I'm going to show you how to change your laptop keyboard in the Dell Latitude D620. Um, I have a new keyboard right here that I ordered from Amazon.com. It was, I think, $20. I will have a link in the description to it. Um, but yeah, let's get right into this. So let me set this off to the side. Uh, the first thing that you're going to want to do is flip the laptop over. Ignore the plane flying in the background. That's mosquito control, you know. Yeah. Anyways, so the first thing that you're going to need to do is take your battery out just so that there is no electrical current going through the laptop that you can ruin it. So now you can flip it back over. We can open this back up. And, um... Right here, you will see the computer. I am missing a couple buttons and... The two key doesn't work, and uh, yeah, spilled pop on it. it. Sucks. So the first thing you're gonna need is a flathead screwdriver or a knife or something, and you're gonna need to open this up, like put the uh, knife in this little tab right here, and then you'll see that this pops up a little bit. So then you can just kind of lift it up, and now if you pull it towards you, it will unhook it out of there, and you can just keep pulling it, and it'll come off just like that. Easy as that. So now you're going to need to take your screwdriver, Phillips screwdriver, and put the screwdriver in these three screws. There's one here, there's one right here, and there's one right here. So we're going to go ahead and take these out. I don't know if the screwdriver is going to fit. Okay, now that that took forever to get out because it was stripped, I have everything basically ready to come out. So you can just lift up the keyboard using these little two things over here and just kind of pull and it will come out. You slide it forward and then you flip it over. And right here, you'll see this little, uh, this little black thing right here. If you fling this forward, it will pop this out. And you can flip this little hinge over and then take this blue tab and pull on it. Don't worry, you won't break anything. And then we have the keyboard out. And uh, this will also, you'll make it so you can access your uh, RAM. There's two sticks of RAM in the computer. This has two gigs of RAM, this computer. One's here, and the other one, stupid airplane. And the other one is on the other side of the computer on the back. <clears throat> so, uh, we can take the brand spanking new keyboard right here. And as you can see, they kind of did a little upgrades on it, like, um, the old keyboard has the old Windows logo, right here has the old Windows logo, this one's got the circle Windows logo, the new one, um, the buttons on top are black, and, you yeah, know, looks probably a little bit different, uh, so what we're gonna do is, is do the same exact thing, we're gonna flip it over, we're going to plug it in. go so it slid in there and we can just kind of move this tab out of the way and then slide this uh, clip back over it and we can flip the keyboard back over we can slide it back in uh, just kind of take it um, maybe a little bit different maybe a little difficult because it might be a different size and all that so might take a second. So now that it just took a little bit, got it in there. So uh, after that, we will take the screws and put them back in. Um, put the middle one back in. And yeah, we're just basically going to reinsert the screws. So, yeah. Okay, uh, now that's that is blah, blah, blah. now that that is down, um, I'm leaving that screw off just because of it's stripped. So now we're gonna put this back on easy. You just kind of slide it back in the spot and just push down. The end is kind of tricky. Okay, and then just kind of push them all down. Make sure all the buttons are in place. Yeah, so now we can reinsert the battery. So just flip it over. Make 
it down, put it back in. These are all locked, all good. So we can flip it over and we'll turn it on for the first time. Let's see if we can get that in shot. Lights work, powering on. And uh, yeah, Max booting up. So we can see if this works. We'll just go into a notepad on the computer and make sure all the keys work. So everything works. Um, and that's about it, guys. So thanks for watching. Please subscribe and go to our website, www.comeup1.tk. Thanks for watching, guys. See you later, and goodbye.